Students from around the world have been putting their robotic skills to the test in a small Alberta town, but they want and hope to make their mark on another planet, Mars. They're competing to see who can build the best rover, and the winner will be announced later today. Anise Haidari has the story. Ben Davidson's never seen the Drumheller landscape. The terrain, uh, it's sort of Margie, I guess. Uh, a little more vegetation here than Mars would have. The Oregon State University student is one of dozens in the southern Alberta town for the Canadian International Rover Competition. Rover as in Mars Rover. Teams from across Canada, the United States and as far away as Poland are putting their robots to the test in Alberta. The challenges are designed to simulate problems the machines could face on Mars. Saskatoon native and competition organizer Justin Garine says Drum Heller was a natural spot. Very similar to Mars, uh, so there's lots of uh, dry, high iron rich sort of environment with low vegetation. For Carleton University student Yannick Brisebois, watching the competition is the hardest part. His team's robot is struggling to move a valve 90 degrees from its previous position. Oh, it's very intense. Um, it's difficult trying to, or watching the rover trying to figure out how to fix it without being able to actually touch it ourselves. Because if the robot was actually on Mars, they wouldn't be able to just step in and fix the problem. But uh, it's very cool just to see our kind of our creation work. A universal feeling for all the students competing, including Oregon's Ben Davidson. That's why his team is here too. I know, robots are cool. <laughs> the next big contest is in Utah next summer. Anisadari, CBC News, Drumheller.